Hello guys, I welcome you to the channel which is Electronics Engineering, Engineering Concepts, Problems and Solutions and uh, this channel is altogether a separate channel and we are going to provide you key uh, concepts, problems and solutions related to the electronics and electronic circuitry, different uh, type of the problems and solutions. The main purpose of this channel is obviously linked to all the concepts, uh, the multidisciplinary concept of uh, aircraft manufacturing, aircraft structures and all the domains related to it. Uh, the starting from uh, the core or from the beginners level that is from the graduate level and uh, moving ahead uh, asking for the contributions from various heads uh, or of departments where students, uh, researchers scholars uh, just to contribute to our channel and if anyone who is willing to have uh, the added services uh, uh, beyond that obviously we're going to provide the services uh, on uh, the given contact details the current uh, video which is uh, the video which is for this channel is uh, is from the electronic uh, electrical engineering iit kharagpur module one version which is uh, power semiconductor devices and the lesson one is actually power electronics An introduction is also given this lesson actually provides the reader uh, the following create an awareness of the general nature of power electronic equipment brief idea about topics of study involved the key features of principal power electronic devices an idea about which device to choose from uh, for a particular application a few issues like base drive and protection of uh, pe devices and equipment common to most varieties we're going to also handle some of the uh, problems and objective related and, uh, and uh, as also a numerical based um, numerical uh, theoretical based problem at the end of this video so let's see just first of all talking about all the, the theory being discussed in uh, the uh, iit kharagpur which is also available uh, by visiting at the channel www.nptel.com which is for the national program for technology and enhanced learning and uh, the, that is, uh, you can actually get all the resources. I have actually uh, converted it uh, there to a uh, text form, easy to read and uh, watch uh, a video uh, so that you can get an idea what it's all about. So for further queries, you can comment, you can ask uh, in uh, the chat section. We're definitely going to correspond or respond accordingly. So power electronics is the art of converting electrical energy from one form to another in an efficient, clean, compact, and robust manner for convenient utilization. This is, first of all, the definition of the power electronics. A passenger lift in a modern uh, building uh, equipped with a variable voltage, variable speed, induction machine drive offers a comfortable ride and stops exactly at the floor level. Behind the scene, it consumes less power with reduced stresses on the motor and corruption of the utility mains. This is the feedback and one, two feed forward, one and reference one ISOL, that is isolation. This is the controller, this is isolation, the driver, the power circuit and protection, the filter that is feedback, this is load feedback too. This is isolation, power supply, auxiliary supply, this is whole uh, the block diagram of a typical electronic converter. So power electronics involves the study of what? Power semiconductor devices in which we're going to discuss their physics, characteristics, drive uh, requirements, power converter. Uh, this is uh, one of our converter, electronic converter, control strategies of converter and digital analog and uh, micro electronics involved, okay, and uh, capacitive and magnetic energy storage elements, rotating and static electrical devices, quality and waveforms generated, electromagnetic and radio frequency interference and thermal management. The typical uh, converter in figure one illustrates the multidisciplinary nature of this uh, subject. Obviously, what we have discussed in the block background illustrates the multidisciplinary nature of uh, this object, which is about the uh, electronic converter. That is why we have chosen uh, the overall uh, aircraft as an uh, as an object to be discussed to be. Uh, handle and also to be discussed in depth when we talk about from theory to 
uh, practical obviously remaining within our limited resources but the purpose is to get an idea a well furnished idea how you can get all the multidisciplinary to be connected and obviously when you have enough knowledge you can impart uh, any student any uh, any customer when you're talking about over the internet or over the YouTube that is the whole purpose that is why we have chosen such a uh, 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 such a uh, uh, such an uh, example or such a case study when we talk about uh, the uh, educational videos or the full fledged educational videos linear operation when we talk about the differences between the linear operation and switching operation active zone selected good linear, uh, linearity between input and output active zone avoided high losses and counted uh, only during tra transients saturation and cutoff zones avoided poor linearity and saturation and cutoff negative bias zones selected low losses Transistor bias to operate around a quiescent point and no concept of quiescent point. Common emitter, common collector, and common base modes. Transistor driven at base emitter and load either on collector or emitter. Output transistor barely protected. Switching aid, network SAN, and other protection to main transistor. Utility, utilization of transistor rating of secondary importance utilization of transistor rating is optimized when we are talking about switching so this is the linear diagram this is the switching diagram with drive gnt drive power main power dt pt and load and that is how you're going to explain so power semiconductor devices can be categorized as uncontrolled and controlled with uncontrolled as rectifiers, in rectifiers we have power silicon, diodes, threads and short free and accessories include DR diac, Zener and MOV. Regenerator which is in the control include uh, SCR, TRIAC, GTO. Non-generative also in, is in the, in, the, in the control which include BJT, MOSFET and IJBT. Integrated include uh, IG, IG, IGCT and PEC PIC intelligent and power modules okay so we going to let's see what our uh, next objective question which is the highest switching speed highest switching speed is MOSFET is MOSFET which is uh, highest voltage current ratings which is highest uh, voltage current ratings uh, that is CSCR which is easy drive uh, features that is also MOSFET can be most effectively parallel that is also MOSFET and can be protected against overcurrents with a fuse that is SCR so this these are the objective type questions and answers now uh, one of uh, another video another and uh, actually question and SCR requires 50 milliampere gate current to switch it on it has a resistive load and is supplied from 100 volt dc supply uh, specify the pulse transformer details and the circuit following it if uh, the driver circuit supply voltage is uh, 10 volt and the gate cathode drop is about one volt okay So the answer would be the most important ratings of the pulse transformer are its volt seconds rating, the isolation voltage and the turns ratio. The voltage seconds is decided by the product of uh, the primary pulse voltage multiplied by the period for uh, which uh, the pulse is applied to the winding. Uh, if the primary pulse voltage supply voltage drive transistor drop the turn on time of the SCR may be in the range 50 microseconds for an SCR of this rating consequently the volt seconds may be in the range of 9 into 50 for 50 micro volt seconds the pulse transformer may be chosen as 1 into 1 for 50 micro volts which is uh, volt into isolation is equal to 2.5 kilo volt and IM is equal to 150 micro amperes. So this is the circuit which we are just completed. Simple gate drive and protection circuit. This is how you're going to use it. Okay. And also series resistance is supply voltage drive resistor drop gate cathode drop 
uh, is in drive 100 uh, milliampere 10 that is supply voltage is 10 minus drive transistor uh, drop is 1 and gate uh, drop gate obviously cathode drop is gate cathode drop is also 1 so just dividing 1, 10 minus 10 minus uh, 10 minus 1 minus 100 divided by 100 so E3 that was be 100 or 80 ohm okay or 49 or 57 ohm nearest available lower value when you have the equipment in front of you that is the series resistance so this is the question all about because it has asked about the circuitry as well and uh, if uh, the driver circuit supply voltage is 10 volt and the gate cathode drop is about 1 volt so this is 10 volt and also this is 1 volt so when we have combined so we can uh, also do resistant uh, lower is 100 so we divided by this and we have the value as 80 ohm or nearest 49 or 57 ohm okay then we have the so this is how you're going to explain uh, with the help of the circuitry when you can also going to have the answer this is written by ag singh i believe this whole whole uh, uh, whole article or whole uh, knowledge or the uh, the whole lectures or module to be uh, frankly speaking or of lesson one power electronics is has been written by ag singh so you can we, we definitely thank uh, the contribution of Mr. A.G. Singh from IIT Kharagpur and uh, also it is uh, uh, because there is no designation being written on uh, when you have actually checked it online uh, but obviously uh, A.G. Singh is the uh, contribution as is the has, uh, uh, is the main author of this uh, module lesson one power electronics along with the questions as well so we definitely uh, thank the contribution but the main purpose as i said is uh, to uh, contribute towards our channel which is electronics engineering concepts problems and solutions and i want you guys that you contribute in the form of comments in the form of queries so that obviously we can work together but you can also share it uh, on other platforms if you see and also uh, this is uh, the main purpose obviously uh, just letting us and enhancing our capability towards educational based uh, services primarily uh, for uh, actually uh, Indian customers and Indian students and also uh, handling some of the syllabus related to the engineering uh, with the help of uh, IITs and different IITs and uh, the different faculty members and different uh, different uh, syllabus and content available online uh, you can also check and visit NPTEL as I said earlier in the in my uh, in my intro you can visit that website and you can check out the details else you can just look at this uh, content and if you are interested you can ask about the cross questioning as well and uh, we'll definitely going to cover uh, those questions and queries you what we have covered in this uh, in this uh, small video is about power electronics power semiconductor devices various categories of control and uncontrolled devices we have talked about in details the differences between linear operation and switching operation we have discussed about uh, the uh, block diagram uh, explanation of uh, the block diagram when we talk about the power electronics or the electronics converter what are the different types of the instruments uh, when uh, already been actually involved and uh, we also have discussed about some of the objective type and also a theoretical numerical based question so i hope uh, this will obviously serve uh, as a foundation for uh, the coming videos in the this channel uh, especially when we are talking about the power electronics and when we are talking about uh, the semiconductor devices this is a very very good uh, right as far as the power electronics and the semiconductor devices is concerned and we duly appreciate and thank uh, the contribution of ag singh uh, behind this right so I'll conclude my uh, video by saying that uh, you can you can actually 
uh, subscribe you can uh, comment you can tap uh, to the bell, uh, bell notification button and you will be keep uh, having the videos on a regular basis so i'm going to end up my video and uh, will keep on following indian institutes of technologies and ptl and also we keep on following different uh, professors different faculty members available uh, across different iits and also we're going to cover uh, our other channels primarily related to the aircraft uh, mechanisms aircraft uh, systems aircraft structures aircraft uh, delivery aircraft manufacturing uh, keeping in uh, in a line uh, with our approach of providing the educational based uh, services through youtube and also keeping in a line on the available resources and i hope that would be enough uh, for you guys to uh, to share or become uh, become a member of uh, the of the channel and also you can share with other guys so that we can contribute at the end of the day towards better understanding of the public but, and towards enhancing uh, the concepts from graduate to postgraduate, from top to postdoc level. And uh, we'll uh, also welcome uh, the contributions from uh, the various research scholars working, especially working in the, the in this in this field of uh, uh, power electronics and they can contribute and we'll do it duly welcome and else uh, anyone from any part of the world who is uh, keen uh, to uh, witness who is keen uh, to gain who is keen to have uh, some enhanced knowledge uh, towards uh, this uh, branch of engineering uh, he or she is most welcome and also the, he or she can contribute uh, towards the channel as well so i'm going to end up my video and i will hope that uh, you keep following uh, keep liking subscribing or even uh, keep uh, uh, notifying uh, when uh, there's a bell button in front of you and i just uh, also uh, uh, apologize for all the distractions if there is any case so but uh, obviously if uh, the sound is clear if the if the text and if uh, the writing is in front of you is absolutely clear then i hope that uh, is uh, uh, the apology would be accepted but obviously at the end of the day it's all about the quality and the production of videos as well so with this remark i'm going to end up my video hope to see you soon till the next video take care and have a nice day